Hello everyone, I'm Ferlin Webster Jr. with MRC TV, and you want to know something? Hillary Clinton is back in the news. Well, I mean, kind of. An artist is basically paying homage to her with the display he created that highlights Clinton's time as a Secretary of State, namely the 62,000 emails she did not delete from her private email server. Now, Hillary found her way back into the spotlight as she sought to make light of this infamous scandal. The Daily Mail reports, the former Secretary of State turned up at an art show in Venice, Italy to look at an exhibit about her time in office where she sat at a replica of the Oval Office's Resolute Desk. Clinton posted her excitement for the art display on Twitter saying, Found my emails at the Venice Biennale. Someone alert the House GOP. The exhibit was done by Kenneth Goldsmith and was titled, Hillary, the Hillary Clinton Emails. The twice-failed Democratic presidential candidate sat at the replica Resolute desk skimming through the emails for an hour, probably to make sure none of the deleted ones got in there, eh? When asked about her email scandal, Clinton said, It was and is still one of the strangest, most absurd events in American political history. Really? Anyway, let's see what the former Secretary of State had to say about this art exhibit. Anyone can go in, they can look at them, there's nothing there. It's a, it, it's a artistic way of making the same point that I made in a book I wrote called What Happened, and that is, there was nothing wrong, there was nothing that should have been so uh, controversial. Okay, Hillary. Now, if you have any knowledge of Hillary's email scandal, you probably have the desire to ask her, what about the emails you deleted? Where are they? I'm sure they're not on display. And sure enough, they were not. Twitter users were not about to let that slide. One user said, you couldn't be more tone deaf. What you did was illegal. You know it. But you are part of the elite, so don't have to worry about consequences. I thank God every day you are not, nor will you ever be POTUS. Another said, hey, can you get the 33,000 too? Those are the ones Americans would be willing to pay to see. Someone else responded to Hillary, and that's for sure the closest she'll ever get to being at an Oval Office desk. Something tells me the use of your word all is about 30,000 emails short, pard. Clinton, who clearly still wants to be president, was trolled over and over by numerous people on social media, and deservingly so. That is all I have for you today, folks. Until next time, I'm Ferlin Webster Jr. with MRC TV.